hello and welcome to the video today we will create on speed tree a tomato plant as you could be behind me i choose to the model of the tomato we will therefore take a minute to analyze this and reproduce it as accurately as possible on speed tree this variety measure approximately 1 meter 50 it's a rather large and stream stem of the orange leaf and tomato Between the leaves and the stem we can see new stem colored garments that the gardener removed. Now that we have all this information we are going to recover every element of this tomato plant, namely a leaf, a tomato and retover stem photo from reference. I photograph all this we find was felt on the speed tree software. At the end of this tutorial we will realize this. To start we will right click on the tree and add the right trunk. We will modify its radius to have the same width between the button and the top of the stem. Finally, we will add some irregularity. Now we will add the branch tubes that will get the leaves of the tomato. For the branch allocation mode we will set this to Philotexy in alternating these tissues. We will proceed to any adjustment, normally the arrangement of each branch, the division on many other parameters. The length of the branch can be adjusted so that the one below is longer than the one above. The front will follow the branch, so we can modify the branch without having to do it on the suite. We will hide the branch by putting in the spine online. With the gravity menu you could be in the branch to your leaking.
we will remove the space by setting to start to zero. If we move the start and the end, we can define the position of the suite. Now we will create a mesh on the material. To do this, you think on the plus and minus button, you make a add new and rename your material. We attribute the corresponding mesh to Kno Leaf Tomato. Now we will add the texture. To do this, you have a two methods. The first is to manually search each texture from a library sp3, and the second is the drag and drop. Opacity is a texture that is composed of black and white. The black color will put transparency. The normal map allows you to add relief. For the mesh, I decided to make them our blender. So I creating one mesh with three different resolutions that will be used for level of detail. Now that we suite are placed, we are going to do whatever small size adjustment, placement, rotate. Anyway, we are gonna touch a lot of cursor. This button allow you add a run mess in each parameter to add more realistic side to the placement of the branch, suites and many other parameters. We will add the branch with the extern parent in any which will allow to complete the stem then we will add a con to gravitate.
Now we will duplicate the branch on switch with the keyboard shortcut Ctrl D or right click and click on copy. Duplicating one or several nodes save a lot of time because you don't need to reparameterization anymore, you just need to uh, do any adjustment. For texturing the stem, you would use the same method as a leaf. As a close detail, there is no need to create a mesh. We can define the texture size according to the UV. At 0, the texture will be large, at the 10, will be much smaller, almost uniform. We move on to the final step of creating the tomato plant, normally editing the tomatoes. To do this, we will add the central stem, followed by smaller stem that will support the tomatoes. In the segment menu, we can optimize the branch. This will reduce the number of the polygon. Try to find the right balance between optimization and realism. We will add a leaf mesh which will place it at the end of the edge stem. We will remplace the plane with a sphere that will act to as a tomato. Finally, we will set the load. We will be able to modify the transition between each load, the number of polygons and many other parameters. We can manage the load either in a general way or manually of each node. That's the end of this tutorial. Thanks for watching. It to the end. So if you want it, I'll understand. I don't speak English properly. You will find all the files in the description to create your whole tomato plant. Do not hesitate to join your Discord also in the description. I see you soon for another tutorial.